Are you tired of spending a fortune on commercial fertilizers while unknowingly discarding one of nature's most effective plant boosters right in your kitchen? Every time you cook rice, you're literally pouring liquid gold down the drain. Today we're diving deep into the fascinating science behind rice water and why this humble byproduct has become the secret weapon of sustainable gardeners worldwide. Picture this. You've just finished cooking rice for dinner and as usual you're about to dump that cloudy starchy water down the drain. But what if I told you that this seemingly worthless liquid contains a powerhouse of nutrients that could transform your garden into a thriving oasis? Rice water isn't just kitchen waste, it's a scientifically backed fertilizer that has been quietly revolutionizing plant care for centuries. The transformation begins the moment rice meets water. As the grains soak and cook, they release a complex mixture of starches, vitamins, minerals, and amino acids into the surrounding liquid. This process creates what researchers have dubbed liquid plant food, a natural fertilizer that rivals many commercial alternatives in both effectiveness and sustainability. The magic of rice water lies in its remarkable nutrient profile, which reads like a plant's wish list for optimal growth. When we examine rice water under scientific scrutiny, we discover a treasure trove of essential elements that directly address the fundamental needs of plant biology. Nitrogen, the backbone of protein synthesis and chlorophyll production, is abundantly present in rice water. This crucial macronutrient drives the formation of new leaves, stems, and roots while maintaining that vibrant green color we associate with healthy plants. The nitrogen in rice water exists in both organic and inorganic forms, providing both immediate availability and slow-release nutrition that sustains plants over extended periods. Phosphorus, another critical component, plays an indispensable role in energy transfer and root development. Plants rely on phosphorus for photosynthesis, flowering, and fruit production. The phosphorus content in rice water is particularly valuable because it's present in a readily available form that plants can absorb immediately upon application. Potassium, the third member of the essential macronutrient trio, enhances plant resilience and disease resistance. This mineral strengthens cell walls, improves water regulation, and helps plants withstand environmental stresses. The potassium in rice water contributes to stronger stems, better fruit quality, and improved overall plant vigor. Beyond these macronutrients, rice water contains an impressive array of micronutrients including zinc, iron, manganese, and B vitamins. These trace elements, while needed in smaller quantities, are crucial for enzyme function, hormone production, and metabolic processes that keep plants healthy and productive. While fresh rice water offers substantial benefits, the fermentation process elevates its potential to extraordinary levels. When rice water is allowed to ferment for three to five days, beneficial bacteria and yeasts begin to break down complex compounds into simpler, more bioavailable forms. This process mirrors what happens in healthy soil ecosystems, where microorganisms continuously work to make nutrients accessible to plant roots. Fermented rice water develops a slightly sour smell and a more complex nutrient profile. The fermentation process increases the concentration of amino acids, which serve as building blocks for plant proteins. Additionally, the beneficial microorganisms that develop during fermentation continue to work in the soil, creating a living ecosystem that supports long-term plant health. The pH of fermented rice water typically drops to around 3.5 to 4.5, making it just a bit acidic. This acidity is particularly beneficial for acid-loving plants like blueberries, azaleas, and tomatoes. It also helps to unlock nutrients that might be bound up in alkaline soils, so plants can access them more easily. Direct soil application remains the most straightforward method. All you need to do is simply pour the rice water directly onto the soil around your plants, making sure to distribute it evenly throughout the root zone. This method is especially effective for established plants with well-developed root systems since they can quickly absorb the nutrients. Plus, the starches in rice water help improve soil structure by feeding beneficial soil microorganisms. Foliar application offers another dimension of nutrient delivery, 
By diluting rice water with clean water in a one-to-one -one ratio and applying it as a spray to the leaves, you can provide plants with immediate access to nutrients through their stomata. This method is especially valuable during periods of rapid growth or when plants show signs of nutrient deficiency. For seed starting and young plants, a diluted rice water solution, one part rice water to two parts clean water, provides gentle nutrition without overwhelming those delicate root systems. This approach you know supports healthy germination and early growth while also establishing beneficial microbial populations in the growing medium. Understanding when and how often to apply rice water is honestly crucial for achieving optimal results without creating nutrient imbalances. The general recommendation is to use rice water once or twice per week during the growing season, with applications reduced to once every two weeks during those slower growth periods. The timing of application also matters significantly. Early morning applications allow plants to absorb nutrients before the heat of the day, while evening applications provide overnight feeding without the risk of leaf burn. It's best to avoid applying rice water during the hottest part of the day, since this can cause stress to plants and reduce nutrient uptake efficiency. Seasonal considerations play an important role in application frequency. During spring and summer when plants are actively growing, more frequent applications support vigorous development. In fall and winter, reduce applications to match the slower metabolic rate of dormant or semi-dormant plants. When we compare rice water to commercial fertilizers, several distinct advantages emerge that make it an attractive alternative for conscious gardeners. The cost-effectiveness is immediately apparent. Rice water is essentially free, created from something you would otherwise discard. This represents a significant savings compared to commercial fertilizers, which can cost hundreds of dollars annually for serious gardeners. Environmental impact represents another crucial consideration. Commercial fertilizers often require energy-intensive manufacturing processes and can contribute to water pollution through runoff. Rice water, being completely natural and biodegradable, poses no environmental risks and actually improves soil health over time. Different crops respond uniquely to rice water applications, and understanding these variations can help you optimize results across your garden. Leafy greens like lettuce, spinach, and kale show remarkable response to rice water's high nitrogen content, developing lusher foliage and extending their productive harvest period. Fruiting plants such as tomatoes, peppers, and squash benefit from rice water's balanced nutrition, particularly the phosphorus content that supports flower and fruit development. Regular applications during the flowering and fruiting stages can significantly improve yields and fruit quality. Root vegetables like carrots, radishes, and potatoes respond well to rice water's potassium content, which promotes strong root development and improves storage quality. The organic matter in rice water also helps create the loose, well-draining soil conditions that root crops prefer. Flowering plants and ornamentals, you know, really thrive with rice water applications, developing more vibrant blooms and stronger stems. The B vitamins in rice water support the metabolic processes necessary for producing the compounds that create flower color and fragrance. While rice water is generally safe and beneficial for plants, understanding potential issues can help you avoid problems and, well, maximize results. Overapplication can lead to excessive vegetative growth at the expense of flowering and fruiting, especially in plants that are naturally vigorous growers. Storage considerations are also important for maintaining rice water quality. Fresh rice water should be used within 24 hours, while fermented rice water can be stored for up to a week in cool conditions. Always check for off-putting odors that might indicate harmful bacterial growth before application. As we face increasing environmental challenges and, you know, rising costs of conventional gardening supplies, rice water really represents a return to sustainable practices that work in harmony with natural systems. This ancient wisdom, now validated by modern science, offers a path forward for gardeners who want to reduce their environmental footprint while actually improving their results. 
The beauty of rice water honestly lies in its simplicity and accessibility. Every gardener, regardless of experience level or budget, can harness its power to create healthier, more productive plants. As you embark on your rice water journey, you're not just feeding your plants, you're participating in a global movement toward more sustainable and responsible gardening practices. Your garden transformation starts with that next pot of rice. Instead of watching those nutrients disappear down the drain, capture them, and, well, watch your plants respond with vigor and vitality you never thought possible. The science is clear, the method is simple, and the results really speak for themselves. Ready to revolutionize your gardening approach with this kitchen-to-garden miracle? Give rice water a try and experience the difference that science-backed, sustainable nutrition can make in your garden. Don't forget to subscribe to Smart Garden for more revolutionary gardening insights and share this video with fellow gardeners who are ready to unlock the hidden potential in their kitchens. Your plants will thank you, your wallet will thank you, and the planet will thank you too.